بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته this is Zubayd Omri I'm trying today to show you how can you export your updated time update time schedule export it and send it for other engineer with no problems with the baseline one issues of one of issues that happen when you send time schedule or updated time schedule for other engineers they will try to open it and find it without baseline so I will show you that the easy way for doing that first thing this is example this is one example this is updated baseline updated baseline time schedule okay this is updated and this is show you that this is updated and you see the baseline columns difference of updated columns or forecast columns or start and finish columns so now what we try to do let's image that I'm trying to send this file for other person or, or other engineer so I go to show you two ways for sending it and the difference ways between them first one go to export and export it as a XER file with a version what you want it then next then next this is the name of project next and use the file what you want to export let's image that in documents and here the ID number for it but here we can say XER file XER version sorry XER format save then next finish it's already successfully exported now we are going to export it by other way by XML be focused here next here you want to choose the baseline that's added on this time schedule choose it select baseline after that okay then next then here we write the name X and I'll just for difference and you will find it as a zip format here and export as compressed finish now we want to see the difference between two exporting okay it's already completed now let's image I am the second engineer and I want to open that file sent to me to follow updating or to complete the previous updating for my previous engineer so what I do let's image that I'm close all now here we can remove this this is the first one and here I want to import first one I import XER file make next project I will find where is it this is and next else next next finish okay here we can write just XER file okay this is the first one let's import the second one XML next searching where is it this is next here you must select the baseline import it okay next next finish now we have two files one XCR and one XML let's wait okay it's already finished completely this is XCR and this is X ML XML file okay now we want to see what is the difference between between the XER and XEM files 
First one, I will open XCR file. When you open XCR file as an updated time schedule, you will find the big problem. The big problem that the baseline is the same of updated time schedule, the same of dates. What does that mean? That means no baseline available here. If you want to check here, you want to check in maintain, and you will find no baseline assigned for your project. And if you want to go to the assign, you will find nothing here. So this is the big mistake you will have if you export your file, updated file, as a baseline. Sorry, as a XER format. This is issue will not happen if you export it as a XML. Let's see. Now, we found here baseline the same of start and finish. So I cannot complete previous updating for the time schedule. So I will close it. And I'm trying to open it as, it, as XML. Open it. Look here. What is the first? If you see the first thing here, if you focus, you will find the same problem of the XER file. The baseline here, the same of start finish. So it is no baseline until now. But where is the difference? The difference, if you want to continue the updating for previous times, sorry, for previous updated time schedule that's sent to you, you want first to go to the per project, then maintain baseline, you will find the baseline already available here. This is, but where is the problem? The problem that the program does not assign the baseline yet. So you want to make assign baseline again, just and make okay. Focus here before assigning and you will find the difference what happened. Look, the difference that it's sent to you to the baseline. So now, after that, you can continue your updating. Why? Because it is already, this is the baseline, and this is the updated. But in the initial, or in the first one, for XCR file, you will not find a sign baseline, and you cannot assign it because it is not available. It is not exported already. So it is important to understand this issue before sending the file for other person. That's I want to show you in this video. Now you can continue. For example, you can continue the updating from, for, for example, this is from 13 April to 26. Okay. You will find the updating already and you make the last date for update for example it will be in 26 april sign you see now program can be updated or sorry project can be updated but in xcr no because you don't have a baseline already. That's I want to show you in this file, and sorry, in this uh, video. I hope everyone will be good. Have a nice day. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.